Hello wine friends, this is Carrie, and I'm here at the Junction Windmill at Saltstone Winery. I'm excited this is my first tasting here in a couple years because they're so popular that every time I come out they're busy and it's really annoying for wine bloggers to be out shooting, you know, films and videos and we have a bunch of tasters. So, we were able to choose our five tastings from their menu of several wines and it was an agonizing choice. I decided to start with their 2019 Solstice Chardonnay, excuse me, Chardonnay which is stainless steel, so there's none of that oak that I don't care for. But if you liked oak Chardonnays, you could taste their 2019 Chardonnay, which is in French oak. And these are from Stillwater Creek Vineyard, which I had the pleasure of touring with Lisa working a couple of summers ago. I chose the 2019 Viognier. It's a 93 point winner from Anton Creek, Creek Corfu Crossing and Connor Reed Vineyards. These are expensive grapes, wow. The 2019 Sundance is a blend of Sauvignon Blanc and Semillon, and I always like those blends, so I had to try it. Katie's here with me, she's gonna try the Grenache, and I asked for the Tempranillo because I'm a huge Tempranillo fan, and then their new release is the 2016 Ruby from Red Mountain and Royal Slope ABA. It's Cab Sauv, 77%, and then the rest is Merlot, and we're both Merlot fans. And we didn't, oh, Katie's gonna try the Grateful Red, which and the Grenache, and there's also a Syrah in the menu. I'm not the biggest Syrah fan, so I didn't want to waste it on a tasting. So we're here at Sawstone. They do have room for walk-ins today, but all of these wineries here at the Junction ask for reservations in advance on weekends, just because it's usually pretty busy. Thanks for watching, and you can see more of our wine news about Woodenville on our Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Pinterest.